Hello, you are welcome to solve this math problem, which is x square minus y square is equal to 65. To find the values of x comma y, such that x comma y is element of a positive integers. Now, solution. From this our problem here, which is x square minus y square is equal to 65. Now, into here, x square minus y square is in the form of difference of two squares. So, this here is same as x plus y bracket times bracket x minus y bracket is equal to this 65. Now, to get 65, it is multiplication of this x plus y times x minus y. So we have choices to get this 65. So 65, it is multiplication of 65 times 1. Or we have another selection, 65 is multiplication of 1 times 65. Or we have another selection, 65, it is multiplication of 5 times 13 it is 65 and we have another selection 65 is multiplication of 13 times 5 now we have these four choices but let's compare x plus y times x minus y so from the comparison of x plus y we compared with x minus y we can see that x plus y is greater than x minus y so, if this is greater than this, the first number should be greater than the second number. Now, 65 times 1. 65 is greater than 1. So, this selection is okay. Here, 1 is less than 65. So, this is not okay according to this comparison here. Here, 5 times 13. 5 is less than 13. But the first number should be greater than the second number. So, this is not okay. Here, 13 is greater than 5, so this is okay. So, we have two cases or two choices. So, the first case, so here, let's call this case 1. Case 1, here it is x plus y times x minus y is equal to 65 times 1. So, here, x plus y times x minus y is equal to 65 times 1 and we have another case we call this case 2 x plus y times x minus y is equal to 13 times 5 so here x plus y bracket times x minus y bracket is equal to this 13 times 5. Now, from here, this here, so it will be x plus y is equal to 65. So here, x plus y is equal to 65. And you have this x minus y is equal to 1. So x minus y is equal to 1. Now, this continuous equation will solve by elimination method. So we add these two equations. So it will be x plus x is 2x. x plus negative y is 0 is equal to 65 plus 1 is 66. Then from here, we divide by 2 in both sides. So this and this will cancel. Then it will be x is equal to 66 divided by 2. It is 33. Now, here we got the value of x. Now, to get y, let's use this equation x minus y is equal to 1. So, from x minus y is equal to 1, here our x is 33. So, it will be 33 minus y is equal to 1. So, here we we'll take 1 to this side. So, it will be 33 minus 1 is equal to negative y. We we'll take this side to be positive y. So, it will be y is equal to 33 minus 1, it is 32. So, we have x comma y. So, x 
comma y is equal to x is 33 y is 32 so here 33 comma 32 so we we'll get this first solution into the first case now to solve from this second solution here here it will be x plus y is equal to 13 so here x plus y is equal to 13 here we have x minus y is equal to 5 so x minus y is equal to 5 now here we add these two equations so it will be x plus x is 2x x plus negative y is 0 is equal to 13 plus 5 it is 18 then we divide by 2 in both sides so this and this will cancel so it will be x is equal to 18 divided by 2 it is 9 then here we got x now let's use this equation here x minus y is equal to 5 to find y to find y so it will be x minus y is equal to 5 here our x is 9 so it will be 9 minus y is equal to 5 so we'll take minus y to this side 5 we'll take to this side so it will be 9 this we'll take to this side to be minus 5 is equal to minus y we'll take this side to be positive y so it will be y is equal to 9 minus 5 it is 4 so here it will be x comma y x comma y is equal to uh, x it is 9 y is 4 so it will be 9 comma 4 so I got the second solution now let's check these two answers if they are correct now to check from our problem whereas let's check for this x comma y is equal to 33 so from here x comma y is equal to x comma y is equal to 33 comma 32 this here this our answer now here we substitute here x square so it will be 33 square minus y square it will be 32 square is it equal to this 65 now 33 square we multiply 33 times 33 now from 33 times 33 here 33 is same as 30 plus 3 bracket times 33 which is 30 plus 3 so 30 times 30 is 900 zero zero plus 30 times 3 is 90 3 then plus 3 times 30 is 90 then plus 3 times 3 is 9 now let's add here this 90 plus 90 is 180 180 plus 9 is 189 189 plus 900 is 1089 so 33 square is 1089 minus 32 square 32 square is same as 30 plus 2 bracket times 30 plus 2 bracket now 30 times 30 is 900 plus 30 times 2 it is 60 plus 2 times 30 it is 60 plus 2 times 2 it is 4 now 60 plus 60 is 120 120 plus 4 is 124 124 plus 900 it is 1024 so 32 square is 1024 then is it equal to this 65 now let's take this minus this here 9 minus 4 it is 5 8 minus 2 it is 6 10 minus 10 is 0 so 65 is equal to 65 so left side and right side are equal then it is true for the value of x comma y is 32 33 comma 32 now let's check for the second second case or second solution of x comma y is equal to 9 comma 4 so from x comma y is equal to 
9,4. Now here, into here, it will be x square, it will be 9 square minus y square, it will be 4. y square is this, so it will be 4 square. Is it equal to this 65? Now from 9 square is 81 minus 4 square it is 16. Is it equal to 65? Now 81 minus 16. Here to we borrow one to be 11 minus 6 is 5. Then here to be 7. 7 minus 1 is 6. So 65 is equal to 65. So left side and right side are equal. Then it is true for the second solution of x comma y is 9 comma 4. So we have this solution here and this solution here. So two solutions. Thank you for watching. Don't forget these steps to miss out. Subscribe to my channel and see you in the next video. Bye bye.